Good morning. Yes, I'm back up in what eventually will be possibly Ian's room. Um, I just wanted to, I know it were crooked. The, the, I slept like a baby last night. It's amazing how that happens sometimes. Um, not because I was up in this bed, but I guess I just finally got feeling well enough to where I could sleep. Matter of fact, I fell asleep early in the evening. Um, but there's some things that I have to... explain and it will probably do me no good let me preface this my husband is home today because and, and it's an unusual thing he will be home as far as we know at this point for quite some time he has worked for the last six, seven, eight months doing two to three people's jobs. I've said that before in videos. Y'all either didn't watch the video or didn't pay attention. Either way. And my hair is a mess. I keep saying that I'm going to dye it tomorrow. And tomorrow hasn't ever come. So, yeah. My ADHD brain ping-ponging around. It just is. I am going to try to start making better notes and not doing stuff so off the cuff. Um, so hopefully I can stay on topic a little bit better because I know that whenever we do a video, I kind of, I get it. Um, what I'm going to address, and I'm just going to do, do it, and I don't care. Um... I, when I say I don't care, I don't mean that I don't care, because I do care. But this is my life. Sarji is very excited to see me. He has been glued to me. I came up here last night because Ian did not know that his papa was not working today. So, I came, I, I folded my futons and I... Um, put them away and I brought my stuff up here so they could have time together what an evil wicked woman I am and if I seem a little sarcastic God, please just look over me because at this point I don't know what else to do and I'm gonna be real honest with you um, yeah, I made a lot of people mad yesterday, but you know what? You did it first. Doesn't make it right. Doesn't make it any better. I'll own that. But you pushed it to that far. I thought that maybe there was a chance that if I did X, Y, Z, it could be squashed. Because you made something about you when it wasn't. I don't know how to explain this to you. For 21 years, my husband has worn a postal uniform. 21 years. We could be retired by now. So, you know, I said this in the video that you all came flying and attacking on. That was entitled Psy. Hold on. Cat's do, getting... My phone is charging and the cat's getting all this stuff. So here's the thing. Y'all seem to think that you're going to get me to stop talking about the post office. It's not going to happen. Because it is my livelihood. I'm not talking about you. So I don't get how hard it is for you to understand that it's not about you. 
Number one, I would not do that to Sean. I would not. Mandy, I don't know why you seem to think. Loretta, my gosh, I thought you knew me better. And Karen, after how you talked to me yesterday, you can keep going right on out of my life. Shame on you. You have never even heard me say this first foul word on this platform. And you're going to talk to me like that? Shame on you. You just keep right on going. Because you took, you were mistaken. Not me. I was stressed. I was in pain. I said that in the video. I was talking about my family, how you took the leap from my family, even whenever I made mention to stuff that was going on with my husband's job, and then brought it back to, because there was a situation, and see, I have to remember, there are other videos that I made and didn't post, so I give you all that grace, that, you know, I made other videos trying to fix this, that I didn't post them because I didn't want to stir this any further. I thought if I just let it go, that it, it would, it would go. That if I just, you know, that maybe we could understand each other. Maybe, um, you know, we could talk like adults and squash it. I was wrong. So here's where we're going to get right down to things. My husband's home right now on a Saturday and will be. Because for eight or so months, he's done the job of two to three people on any given day. Two people from October-ish on. And I've said that in videos. If you haven't watched my other videos, then you don't know. So I need to keep that in mind, I guess. So, here's where it gets, where it just puzzles my mind to no, I even made a video the next day and told you it wasn't about you again. I don't know why you all are getting so upset over my freaking life. See, the, see, there's the, there's this thing that y'all have forgotten. Back, it's been some time because, you know, things have been, you know, finances have been a little, and I've not been able to do what I would like to do in a lot of cases. Um... I sent, remember, remember, sentimental things, remember, things that I, whenever I sent them to you, I said, don't make a big deal out of this, this is between me and you, remember, because that's how I do things, I'm only having to bring it out now because you won't, you won't see reason. And I don't know why. I don't know why you would think that I would do this. You seem to think that I'm caught up on this, that, and the other when it comes to the drama community. And you know good and well that I'm not. I have been over here doing my own little thing as I normally do. I've caught a stream here and there. I'll own up to it while I was sick. And trust me. No, I want no part of it. I really want no part of it. Every time I catch some type of a stream for whatever period of time. Um, no. You made me mad. You made me 
very angry. And yes, I called you out on it. And I will continue to do so. You made me mad. You had no right, no reason. I tried to tell you to begin with that it wasn't about Sean. I have a video that I debated because I made it. It was one of the ones that I made while I was sifting through the feelings and deleted. Even said in several videos that it had been so many different tries because I had something would come out and I would just delete it and go, you know, that's not the right thing that I want to say. I'm going to upload it. It's entitled, It's Finally My Turn. I'm going to, I've uploaded it. I'm going to unlist it. Um, it's been up there for a while. Because I'm going to give you exactly what you did to me. I extended an olive branch. Thinking all of this was squashed. Thinking that you understood Veteran to veteran, Sean, friend to friend. There have been times that I have offered whenever you were coming through town in your little Mustang, remember? It's like, you know, if you need us, you're driving right close to us. If we can do anything when you had a flat tire. I said, why didn't you call me? I'm such and such miles away. We would have come and fixed the flat tire. Remember? Remember? And I've got this, I've still got, I sent you a message the day that all this went down and told you that it wasn't about you. You never bothered to read the message or acknowledge it. I've done all I can do. I've stayed in my own lane since I've been on YouTube. For a reason. Because I don't want this. You. Made it. Impossible. For me to not. I joined your members. In the hopes. With a hunch. With That maybe an olive branch. Might. Might. Fix. Help fix things. Knowing that. It might not. But hoping that it would. And you threw it right back in my face. Because see I. Couldn't. Do that for a period of time. So I didn't. It was also said. Nasty Karen. Nasty mouth Karen. It was also said that I only come, came into your. Um. Uh, chats briefly and to brag um, I wanted people that I cared about to share in the joy that I thought that that, that friendship was reciprocated I wanted you to share in the joy of the accomplishments of my grandson shame on me Shame on me. Uh, probably should have, could have worded what I was saying better. I admit that. I admitted it before. But at the time, I was not at liberty, and I was under... I don't want to say but, because that kind of cancels out. At the time, I was under so much strain, 
so much tension, so much going on. And even now, I cannot tell you the magnitude of everything that is going on in my world. Right around that time was when flooding started happening. My home. Storms started happening. I've been sick, down with, in, down with my back, the whole nine. So whenever I addressed that, I had talked about that. I talked about my family. How you made the leap from my family to you, I don't get. And of course, I'm, but let me back up because it was said that I say things that, and I come off as if I know more than others, and that's not what I mean. I know what I see. I know what I mean. Okay? So, this is not in any way, shape, or form changing that you made me upset, that you hurt me. And that I never, ever, ever dreamed in my wildest days that you would do this. All of you, again, I'm going to reiterate, up until yesterday when you blocked me, Loretta, which goes away from the fact that, you know, if I lost you as a friend, I didn't gain you as an enemy. Imagine. We've had conversations, because see, I still have those texts. Nice, good conversations. I won't ever drop them. Don't worry. I don't do that. But see, you picked a side and didn't listen. You didn't come into my come on to my comment section to listen to what I had to say. I doubt very seriously that any of you that commented actually watched the video in its entirety that y'all went nuts on. And yes, I'm thinking it's squashed. I watched the members thing twice. Because I seen where it was brought up, and I thought to myself, are you serious? And then I went back and watched it again, and realized that it was a, it was to me and about me, and the thank you for seven bucks that you even put in my comment section. Really? Yet, I've called nobody no names. back up. I haven't called any names. Got to separate my, you know, Kentucky grammar and my regular, and my, how I'm supposed to speak. I've said nothing negative. But you think that you're going to tell me that I can't talk about my life on my channel. I'm afraid you're going to have to think again. And I don't, I, I had no, inc I had no designs on any kind of drama. Your accuse, your accuse, your accusations, I'll get the word out, against me are baseless. Absolutely, positively baseless in the members only live stream that you did you were giddy about not being a part of the post office and I that's fine with me I wish you well doesn't change the fact because see this wasn't about you I've always wished you the best I've always wanted the best for you. I told you and Mandy when you first got together, I wanted you to have the best life. Wanted you to be better, be have the best. Remember, that ain't changed. I would tell that to my worst enemy. Just that simple. And I'm having to go off track I don't, I don't, 
I'm sorry that you took what I said the wrong way. And if that sounds narcissistic, it will just have to sound narcissistic. Because that's the only way that I can come to grips of apologizing for my part. Because there never was, a, was any malintent. There was no malice. There was nothing in what I was talking about. You see, I was talking about a situation here. With my husband's job, where he works, not him directly, but it affected him. It affected a friend, someone that is a friend of ours. He was facing, he had been in some hot water. And see, I, what I told you was not wrong. I told you I've seen it twice. I didn't say that Sean got fired. I don't know. Far as I know, he resigned and he's happy with the decision. The rest of it I could care less about. That's what came out of your mouth. That's who I, that's who I, try, I take you at your word. I'm going to tell you that, you know, postal life's been good to me. Difference of opinion. And is it an easy job? No. But it's been good to us. It's paid our bills. It's bought our cars. It's fed us. It's provided us with means to take care of things that needed taken care of. My father retired postal after he retired military. 20 years at both. 21 years Army. 20 years at the post office. He would have stayed longer, but the cancer came back. You see, I'm sorry that you twisted a, a, either the clip or whatever and took it the wrong way. I'm sorry. And I, I'm, I'm not being narcissistic. I'm being honest with you. Because I don't know any other way to be. You twisted what I was talking about. And maybe I did not, maybe I, because maybe in the state and frame of mind that I was in, maybe it came off that way. And for that, I apologize. Because it never was, never was it intended to be anything other than my life. I talk, and, and, and I, when you came attacking, my reaction was to defend myself, of course, because I talk about my boring life, and I own up that it's boring. Most of the videos on this are to make memories for myself and Ian, for Ian to have, because I wished I had them for people that, you know, like my dad, my uncles. I wished I had something that I could refer back to. So I'm going to release the other video against And remember, it was filmed several days ago, but I'm going to put this one first. And maybe, just maybe, you'll listen to the entire video and you'll grasp the concept. That none of this had any bearing on you. And anybody that's watching this video, let me say it real clear. Nothing that I spoke of in the video entitled Sigh had anything to do with Sean Curley or Mandy Curley. Is that clear enough? Is it clear enough? Because if this is, this, this is not me trying to get into drama, this is me trying, I've tried to make it right. 
And Mandy, I'm going to tell you straight up, you pissed me off. You hurt me, and then you pissed me off. And after this, this is my final time trying to explain it and trying to explain myself. I'm done. And I don't, see, I don't have to, I didn't have to do this video and take 30 minutes out of my day. I didn't have to do any of this and explain, I didn't have to explain, even respond to your comment. I could have deleted it and been done. I tried to reason with you. I tried to let you know that it wasn't about you. I even said in the explanation, it has to do with me. And even in yesterday's video when you made me mad because you threw my membership in my face. You know, it's something I was trying to do just to try to help to, hopefully, maybe, I knew it could get thrown back in my face, but I also had a hope that you wouldn't. So, again, you hurt me and you made me mad. And this is it. I'm done. I'm going to release the other video after I load this video. And you can do what and say whatever you want to. I know who I am. I know what I meant. I've explained myself. I don't know if you need chalk, crayons, paper, or whatever else. But I'm done defending myself because I know who I am and what I meant. Have a good day, and I wish you the best. It wasn't about you. It wasn't. If you are, I'm going to shut up. Have a good day. See you, bye.